Experiments to determine how plants respond to climate change appear to greatly underestimate shifts in the timing of flowering and leafing in plants due to global warming. That's the conclusion of a study conducted by a team of biologists and other scientists from UC San Diego and 21 other institutions in the US, Canada, Sweden, Switzerland, and the UK. Predicting plant responses to climate change has important consequences for estimating future impacts on the human water supply, the pollination of crops, and the overall health of ecosystems. Long-term historical records show that many plant species have begun producing leaves and flowers earlier in the season, in step with warming temperatures over recent decades. Because historical records are not available in most locations, and climate change may produce temperatures higher than previously recorded, ecologists often rely on experiments that warm small field plots in open-top chambers and greenhouse-like structures. In this way, they are able to estimate plant responses to temperature and to project future conditions. But the team's analysis of 50 plant studies on four continents found that the shifts predicted in leafing and flowering to temperature underestimated the change by at least fourfold compared to long-term records. The scientists suspect this discrepancy may be due to how researchers manipulate temperatures and how accurately they measure them. They discovered the sensitivity of plants to temperature varied with the design of each kind of experiment, which ranged from heating cables in the soil, small greenhouse-like structures, and heating above plants. The researchers found that those experiments that heated the plants from above produce more consistent advances in flowering. For more on this study and other news in the biological sciences, go to biology.ucsd.edu.